might be my favorite problem today because it looks so bad, but it's actually really, really easy to do. It says here, find the definite integral, find the area under the curve from 0 to pi thirds of secant squared of x dx. Uh, this goes really quick. If you've memorized your integrals, then we can just integrate this now, can't we? If we can just integrate this quickly, integrate here, and integrate here. The integral of, of this thing right here is tan of x, isn't it? And because we're going to use the fundamental theorem of calculus, we're going to take tan of x as evaluated from 0 to pi thirds, right? And then we're going to just go straight to that. Uh, and as we go straight to that, it's going to look like this. We're going to take f of b minus f of a, right? Here's the fundamental theorem of calculus. f of b being pi thirds, f of a being 0, that is f of 0, f of pi thirds have to keep a couple things in mind. One, that tan, uh, sorry, tan of x is equal to sine x over cosine x. Another thing we have to keep in mind is that pi thirds is the same as 60 degrees, uh, and that their sine cosine values are 1 half and three, uh, square root 3 over 2. Also, that 0 degrees have cosine, uh, 0 radians has cosine value of 1 and a sine value of 0. So that's pretty easy. So f of pi thirds is sine of pi thirds, and sine of pi thirds is square root 3 over 2 over 1 half, that's that, minus, and here we have sine over cosine. Sine of 0 is 0. Cosine of 0 is 1. That's really helpful, right? We're getting there already. We have a, this in the form of a complex fraction, so you, right, what we're going to do here is to cure this is we're going to bring this up as its reciprocal. In that case, if this is going to come up as 2 over 1, then this 2 will cancel this 2. And our answer, our final solution, is the area is square root 3. All right, so I think that really wasn't bad at all. I think that was a really quick one. It looked terrible, but I think it went fine.